All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. This is, of course, Predator Magic. I am your host, DM Cross, and I'm joined, as always, by the rest of the council. Going first, she is Mono White. She likes to blow everything up, and her name is Danny Cross. Hi, hi. And, of course, we have somebody who likes to make us all miserable, at least if you watched the last video. He likes to draw cards and counter spells. John? I draw all the cards. And sometimes we get to, too. It depends on how you want to play that day. And last but not least... He's super mean, but we don't let him have any fun. Again, if you're watching the last video, our newest player, our newest predator, Valdor. What's up, buddy? Mono blue sucks. <laughs> the saltiness has not ended. White sucks, too. I blew your uh, creature up first. Yeah, instantly. You did multiple times. Uh, I did it multiple times, but I was the first one to do it. Back so this week <laughs> we're apparently not over you know last game <laughs> however this game is going to be completely different right no i'm still playing mono blue god damn it <laughs> <laughs> all right john what are you playing this week i'm playing bitey the imaginary friend that's, um that's not his name no it's toothy <laughs> comma imaginary friend <laughs> <laughs> It's a four mana one one because I like value. Uh, it says whenever you draw a card, put a one one counter on it. And when it leaves the battlefield, draw cards equal the number of one one counters on it. Uh, because I felt so bad about combo mono blue, I decided to play the worst thing possible in mono blue. And you guys are seeing a tribal deck and not even a good tribe. What What is Toothy's creature type? Uh, illusion. Oh god! Oh no! <laughs> Those things that when they get targeted, they sacrifice themselves. Yeah. Oh. I do. I do want to point out one thing though. One, of course, wizards eventually fix that. So good on you, wizards, for figuring out that's a terrible idea. Two, they did something really good with Toothy, and he doesn't have to die for you to draw the cards. He, he could be bounced. He could be exiled. He just has to leave the battlefield. So that's actually a great thing going for him. So I think that's actually at least pretty cool. Um. Toothy, that sounds familiar. I thought somebody else was playing Toothy. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm playing the partners of Peer and Toothy. All right, well, we know what Toothy does, so what does Peer do? If one or more counters will be put on a permanent, <laughs> your team controls that many plus one plus one counters of those kind of counters are put on permanent instead. So he gives uh, you extra counters, is what you're saying. Yep. And you're playing them both. Yep. Okay. So, uh, for those of you who don't know uh, or haven't caught on yet, we are. This is our Battle Bond episode. Ta-da! Surprise. Uh, the big thing from Battle Bond was probably the partner with commanders. Uh, there was what six of them, I believe. And the partner with are a little different from the original partners from a couple of commander sets ago, where they were fifteen creatures with partner and they could be mix and match however you wanted. This one, each partner with is a specifically two card combo. So Peer and Toothy can't be partnered with any of the other partners. It's they only go together. So they do allow your deck to be two colors or one color. Like John's gonna only only gonna be playing mono blue for his because he doesn't have Peer, whereas Danny's gonna have access to both colors. They do both get to go in the command zone and basically like everything else is regular for a partner, minus really the fact that they are specifically tied to each other. So with that being said, Valdor, are you also running partners? I am. I'm running Sylvia Brightspear and Korvath Brightflame. So Sylvia is a three mana, two and a white, uh, two, two human knight that has double strike. And dragons, my team controls have double strike. Oh. Where Korvath is a six CMC, uh, five and a red, three, four dragon. That's flying in haste, and it gives all knights I control flying in haste. So, I am playing Boros Aggro. You're so playing. I'm... You're playing Aggro. No. Oh, wow. Hey, it sounds like a dull deck for two commanders named Bright. Wow. It's, uh, it's going to allow me to <laughs> punch John in the face before he has a chance to lock people out. So, for those of you who didn't notice a couple episodes i started using this shade gif and i'm going to use it constantly throughout this uh intro when i'm doing editing holy <laughs> i like the fact i'm gonna i'm gonna compliment valor i'm gonna give him a little something i like the fact that it's kind of like having two tribes in one because your dragon commander helps out your knights whereas your knight commander helps out your dragons and if yes. you ever look at their art it looks like sylvia is actually riding corvath he's like he's 
her partner, but he's also kind of like her mount. Um, so it's kind of cool that you're you're making dragon knights. Like that's the underlying theme here. So I think yeah, that's I'm, actually awesome. Like I said, I'm definitely hoping to be a little more low to the ground and uh, get under you know a lot of control that's there. Okay. I will <laughs> say that Gavin Verhey played this against me when I was spell slinging with him in SCG Con back a few months ago, and he destroyed me when I was playing my Galta deck. Like, it wasn't even close. I just died in, like, ten turns. It was terrible. Yeah, I know the feeling. <laughs> Danny played against them, too, for a partner that's not being uh, portrayed in this one, because I am not playing uh, the coin flipper ones. I am playing Crab the Unredeemed and Regna the Redeemer. So Crab is a black demon. He's a 3-3 three, three, for four and a black. He has partnered, of course, with Reg uh, his wife, Regna, and he has black sacrifice X creatures. Target player draws X cards and gains X life. Put X plus one plus one counters on Crab and Redeem. So if I have a bunch of creatures, I can sack them all to draw cards or make somebody else draw a card because these were these uh, creatures in this whole set was kind of built for like two-headed giant. So I could potentially give somebody else. I could even mill somebody else out. You never know. Um, but yeah, he makes himself bigger. He gains life, he draws cards for sacrificing creatures. Sounds exactly like my kind of deck. And it's even better when he's paired with his wife, Regna, who is a angel. He was a demon. She's an angel. Uh, you heard me right. Flying 4-4 four, four for 5 and a white. And at the beginning of each end step, if your team, or yourself in this case, gained life this turn, create two 1-1 one, one white warrior creature tokens. So he gains life for sacking tokens, which she makes when she gains life. Huh? Synergy? Yeah, I'm excited. It, it, it's almost like Battle Bond partners were designed that way. Oh, it's so good. I can't wait. I just want to combo all over you people. Not like infinite combo, but I just want to do synergistic things all over you guys. So, yeah, I'm excited. Battle Bond was super cool. We did want to do this episode a little while ago. Uh, unfortunately, we couldn't due to the simple fact that it took them a little while to put the partner with commanders on MTGO. So we've been waiting on it. They are finally here and we're excited. So if you guys are ready, are you guys ready? I personally am ready. I shall not speak for anybody else. Oh, okay. It's about time you learned your place. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go out so fast this game. <laughs> and there's the shade gif again. All right. They're ready. I'm ready. Hopefully you guys are ready. So let's get in the game. All right. So we are in the game. Uh, once again, John somehow gets to go first, even though he won last game. Magic Online Gods, what are you doing? But... We'll work. see how the good part is. I'm pretty sure that blue would be like the hacker color, right? So I'm, I think John is just hacking. That, that seems about right. Confirm nor deny. Cannot confirm or deny that that's 100% true. Got it. Got it. Got it. One drop. Ooh, look at you go with that Kaladesh land. Okay. I know. So good. You know, I normally don't ever run these in EDH. Yeah, because if you don't get them in the beginning, they're just bad tap lands. Yeah, they provide no value besides coming in and play tap. But... So they're like me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that escalated real quick. That self burn. I was but... terrified what Danny's turn one green mana play was going to be. Forest oh, tap. Back. Sylvan Library. I uh, not Sylvan Library. Sylvan Tutor. I mean, could have been. Yeah, could have been. Uh-oh. Someone's not tapping out. With his two blue manias. I volunteer as first to be hit. <laughs> <laughs> Got a reality um... shift. No, no. If if you if you don't actually even if you level it up twice, I'll take first hit. I mean, I could. I, I don't know if I want to level up dice. Gotta get You'll that take rock. first hit. You volunteer tribute. Sure. Okay. Kongify, you... got him. I, I mean, mean I could, that's, but that's not yeah, worth no, it. you no, it's not. Don't do it, please. There you go. Thank you for volunteering. <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to it. <laughs> <laughs> Path exile. No. Hashtag got him. So she just didn't die and tutored, though. That's scary. She? Oh, that's you. I'm so yeah, used to Danny uh... playing that. <laughs> yeah. She's not even playing that color this week. 
I took it from her. You can bounce it. Nothing. No, I mean, there's no reason to to I hold mean, up mana if I'm not going to counter and lighten tutor. So you guys know that I'm not doing anything. <laughs> oh god, please stop. Neither hey, holy Nimbus. Flanking? You're playing <laughs> a <mechanic>. flanking card? <laughs> and auto-regenerate. Jeez. That's actually amazing. It's... Oh, any player can activate this? Yeah, yeah. You, you, every, anybody could pay two colorless to deactivate the regenerate for a turn. I'd like to. Not do that. I mean, right now, probably not. All right. Oh, man. Am I the rampiest person here? What? Mm hmm. For now. Look at, look at me go. Oh, gosh. I see clearly. No. Nope. Mm -mm. You made fun of me when I wanted to. Whoa, whoa. Whenever you can. You. But. Oh, it's not target creature. Okay. Oh, no. Return target creature oh, to its owner's hand. I mm -hmm. thought it was only you, and I was like, but, but they'll die. <laughs> this is bad for your deck. What are you doing? Maybe I don't care if they Boom. die. Maybe I knew. Oh, wow. Really? Why are you like this? Highest life <laughs> total. <laughs> I mean, you've already been booped. That's why I volunteered for tribute. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, Jeez. one one, I'll take it. Jeez, the knights getting in. This is this reminds me very much of how the game with Gavin went. I sat here, tried to build up a board state, and he just punched me in the face a lot. I mean, why am it, I getting hit? We all got I, hit. I was Danny. spreading the love around. Everyone's got hit once. I don't I want that kind of love in my life. Agreed. I don't want to wait for our lives I'm, to be over. Well, good because you don't have to wait long. Magic. Yeah, this is now Praetor Magic Karaoke Night. <laughs> Seems to happen a lot. It does. Because karaoke is awesome when you had enough to drink. Speaking of which. Agreed. Speaking of which, I need to drink after these assholes. Every, every time. <laughs> every time we record. <laughs> oh, God. Danny, would you please, like, everybody else is just trying to play fair magic. This is gonna Fair. be this is gonna be actually a decent uh, test of the old uh, oh mono well not mono but oh green ramp is too strong. I mean, green ramp is pretty amazing. Yeah, she's the only person playing green. If she goes off, oh, I can't put. Oh yeah, I can. There you go. I mean, you can't pay one. No, nope. I don't. I'm kind of mad. I've only got spells in hand and no creatures. So you have two creatures that are your commanders. I know, but I'm saying in hand, like I have. Here you go, creatures. buddy. Thanks, buddy. Just in case you need to <laughs> shuffle your deck. I was actually, nice. I was tempted. Plus, I wanted the audience to see that I could target you. You stop it. Hmm. So yeah, the uh, the partner with cards battle bond was kind of made to be a two headed giant um, format or set. So if the you get one partner in a pack you always get the other one they always came together which was a really cool thing by the way i thought that they did so you could potentially have somebody play just toothy and somebody play just peer or just sylvia and just corvath or just crop you know you get the picture uh and whenever the first person casts theirs you can get the other person to go find theirs but they're partners and buddies listen here. everyone gets a night listen here we're being beat up by the Boros, Boros deck at the table, guys. I mean, isn't that, isn't that the point? No, Boros isn't supposed to be good. Boros isn't good. Oh, wait, what did I say that? <laughs> I was like, uh No, that's just on the podcast. Yeah. I don't know. I, I have a feeling there's definitely a wipe or something coming soon. I wish. I will get this demon out, though. It's a demon. Uh, so this is tap of black sacrifice X creatures. All right. Oh, heck free yeah. <laughs> <laughs> free shuffle. I felt it was only fine. appropriate. <laughs> I did fail to find. I did go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I hit no for mine. Yeah. Don't worry. I, I definitely have a feeling that John's going to be bouncing my creature soon. 
I hope so. God, I hope so. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's just you got off to such a quick start. The one, the two, the three. Yeah, no, this that was literally my opening hand was those three and the lands to cast them <laughs> and two lands and a couple other things. I'm like, well, let's do this. Look, I want to deal with his board, but she keeps playing toothy. She played one time this game. <laughs> I know, but there can only be one. No, no, that's that's a different show altogether. They're but do you realize how bad it gets when she has peer with him? Yeah, I can't compete yeah. with that. So I have a I mean, Peer and Tutti in my Jota Planeswalker deck. Mm -hmm. It's silly. You're it does, silly. It, you're right. Hold on. I gotta actually read what flanking does real quick. I've forgotten. Nobody has <laughs> yeah. So flanking, whenever a creature without flanking blocks... A blocking creature uh, gets minus one, minus one. Yep. It's a debuff. Mm -hmm. It is. For every blocking creature. Yep. So you would... If your yeah. creature wasn't indestructible, if the knight wasn't indestructible and it was a 3-3, Crab would die to it without trading. Yep. Oh, yeah. Indestructible. There's the thing. There's that, too. Like I said, I'm expecting, especially from Seth, a board wipe soon, or bounce yeah. from John. Would love to. Danny's just going to beat me in the face. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's hard to compete with a one, two, three drop and apparently model white knights. <clears throat> that is not, sir, a creature. I know. I don't <laughs> want to play my creature, but I have to. <laughs> Any the creature? most expensive illusion I have. With Jabouncin. It's targeting the no, one that gets indestructible. Yeah. I, I am needing to get used to these new uh, new uh, icons. Tag. Yeah, they look good though. I mean, they look noticeable. I think it looks nice good. though. I like it. I like that you know what they're doing. You you know what it is. Oh, <laughs> they have the regenerate. I like it. I'm thinking that works. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, do just... I look like the kind of guy with a plan? I just run around chasing cars. What would I ever do if I found one? Ooh. No, nope, that's a car. bad sound. Ooh, that's uh. That's just a myriad landscape. Calm down. Nobody's impressed. Stop it. I'm impressed. If you play Armageddon right now, I will be pissed. <laughs> no, God, why would I run that game card in a casual game? You didn't about? have to specify casual game. <laughs> we uh, we had somebody do that to us. Yeah, the it's first time we ever played with him. Uh, no, I had to resist after he played Iona, naming black against my Edgar Markov deck. Mm -hmm. Ooh, that's a really good card for your deck. That's what I drew. Yeah. Um, I don't know. You gonna put it on something? Yeah, I am. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. So. Oh God, it's a three-three now. It is. Yeah, I yeah. leveled it up. Jesus. So it's three-three first strike. I want. Want to want to smack somebody? Can Can we acknowledge Danny. the fact that I have a human rebel knight illusion? He's not a real human being. <laughs> you don't know that. I almost but, feel like it could be a changeling. Like it just has so many creature types. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, changelings are pretty... New mercy rule on MTGO, if you get the five creature types, it's just automatically a changeling. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. I'm sure there would be a deck that does it. Like, that would all be its whole point. Why? Oh, I was actually I hoping total. you'd attack me, so I could see if regenerate worked. It, yeah, regenerate work. Will I get a Phantasmal Image back, or will I get a Knight of the Holy Nimbus? Because one of those no. is a lot better. Regenerate causes it to uh, basically, basically yeah. be pulled out of combat. Yeah. It doesn't ever gotcha. hit the behavior. Yeah, so it doesn't... It's not like it dies and comes back. Alright, I got a Regenerating Illusion. I guess that works. 
Oh, that gets around the targeted and its sacrifices. Mm -hmm. mm. Unless I target it. Then it'll still die, I think. I don't know. Magic's weird. <laughs> I don't know. That's a... Uh... These are cards. Let's just agree to you never... You should probably discard match. one. Yeah. <laughs> I'll discard that one. Ooh. Ooh. If that's your worst card, I'm terrified. <laughs> I'm playing Tribal Illusions. <laughs> <laughs> you keep saying that, but part of me thinks you're just going to step up and, like, smash somebody. I have cute combos with my creatures bouncing themselves because they're annoying. Oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> yeah, that's going to be most of my creatures, huh? I'm going to try to do a thing. Well, I'm not... Bouncing Elspeth. Ew. They're, I'm getting blockers. You calm down. You getting blockers that you can then sacrifice? No, you can't. I don't have mana now, but that would be the end goal, yeah. Yeah. That doesn't super help him when he has, if he sacrifices his blockers as you hit him in the face. I mean, if I were to block and then sack, it would be fine, but... He doesn't have trample yet. Yet. I'm, I'd be more worried about flying. That's true. Uh, yeah, that's a thing. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah. He could. Korvath is six or seven? Six. 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 Okay. Yep. But like I said, I'm getting another creature bounce this turn. Only if it's the scariest one. I mean, I have a 3 3. I oh. keep hitting. No, oh, you keep hitting other people. I don't <laughs> care too much about that. I've been trying to love everybody equally. I just like well, to I just saying. Want that. <laughs> yeah, have him hit himself. No, no. Yep. The, uh, uh, that's also fine. I'm, I'm perfectly fine with ping yourself. I, I, I can't. There's no way I could do that. Find a way. Can't or won't. Uh? Can't. Currently. Oh. Get him a body bag. She said. I what art is this? Oh. I really wanted that card to live. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, you're you're scary enough without you needing or getting the card advantage, so I think you're fine. Yeah, no, that's fair. Uh, Mask of Memories is pretty awesome. I mean, there's Equilibrium. Could have hit. I mean, she doesn't mind if uh, Toothy gets bounced as, as soon as yeah. he has counters. I, that's pretty much the deal, is I can just bounce Toothy, but she'll still draw off of it. Yeah, you can bounce your own Toothy. I can, but I don't have as many blockers. Yeah, we're playing. It's fine. we will all be fine. That's the only time I haven't played, Pierre, because I don't have any creatures in hand still. Jeez. Well, when Toothy eventually dies, you might draw into one. Oh, let me bounce him for you. I got this. <laughs> Draw some cards and get creatures. I mean, yeah, why not help her draw some cards at this point? I think um, I think the only way that he would have been still kind of balanced, but even stronger if it was just equal he to his to power. Hand. Yeah. And just so everybody's where I drew a land. Oh, yeah, that's right. Two hand is a default uh, thing. Oh, nice. Of all the options, hand is the only one that defaults. Oh, really? Yeah, for Magic Online, because nobody cares typically if it goes to your hand. It's any other zone that you're worried about. I I completely forgot about that. That's not like a new thing. That's oh, way okay. old. <laughs> That's not a new thing. We're just paranoid and don't trust Moto. <laughs> that sounds accurate. That's fair. Ooh, it's a strip mine. Don't worry about it. It's a strip mine. Hmm. Playing mean things. I was too lazy to get lands. I was like thirty-five islands done. Is that really it? Mm-hmm. Nice. I was trying to max out my budget. Oh like, god. So At least you can't do budget. that. I'm still like five under. Yeah, I wish I could. Oh, well, there goes my planeswalker, I'm sure. Oh yeah. Um Let's see. I'll pay the two for your night. 
<laughs> I know you would. <laughs> I mean, and then I'll block it with my night illusion. Though I'm, I'm debating if I want to go student of warfare at you anyways. You won't hit me. You won't kill any of my creatures either. Boom. Nah. He's bluffed before. Oh. I know. Get he can on. read fleeting image. Shh. <laughs> oh, no, I will not pay seven mana for a card I cannot use. <laughs> I will not pay seven mana, which I do not have. <laughs> <laughs> the other part. Bye bye, Elspeth. That's fair. I got some value out of her. Yeah. I was more worried about the uh, minus effect for once I start playing more dragons. Well, so I want to make a land drop, and only one person has really good stuff as a graveyard. Not me. Nope. My recursion. No. I don't have a graveyard. That's why I said it. I'm the only one without one. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I'm hearing some thoughts over there. You shouldn't call her that. It's offensive. God damn it. <laughs> I didn't even know what that meant up until a little bit ago. Maybe yeah, it's, it's actually really offensive for what most people use it as. I... <laughs> oh, God. My... You guys. Maybe I'm showing my age. I actually had to ask one of my friends what dabbing was. I, I did not understand what the what dabbing was. I do not understand this attack. I'm old. Oh, I understand this attack. <laughs> I, uh... I, uh... totally had to ask somebody the same question, actually. I still don't understand it. What, dabbing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It is a I'm physical my, body movement. My... There's not much more to it. It's just posing. You, you pose on yeah. them. You flex on them. Posing, flexing, flanking. You will lose. <laughs> flanking. No, that's that's not the same thing at all. That's a tactical maneuver. Completely different kind of thing. Well, yeah, but when you dab on somebody, you disarm them. Do you? Have you ever been dabbed on and not been stunned? <laughs> <laughs> that's fair. Yeah, that's just my age showing, I think. Better your age than your IQ. Sir? I mean... I'm sorry, what? what? <laughs> Did you just... <laughs> hey, look, you want to go find your peer? There it is. It, it's, no, it's right there. Yeah. Can it pull from the graveyard? Uh, no, it's a library. Watch from their library. Book. Yeah. Or, yeah was, or their hand, but that made no sense. I mean, it would not make any at all. I want I want the next unset to allow you to search your own hand. <laughs> search target opponent's hand. Search any player's hand for land. Put it on the battlefield. I'm sad. I haven't gotten any of my cool cards. I mean, you're doing all right. Do, do you really oh, think that. Fleeting Image was the one I was going for? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, Fleeting Image is an amazing blocker and highly synergistic with Equilibrium. Yeah, I was yeah. about to say. So. Your command is getting pretty big there, buddy. Yeah, I'm sure I'll die. <laughs> I mean, I would imagine that is half of what you want it to do. As I well just as... want it to be an illusion. Nope. Success! Yeah. You know how I am with low, uh, low expectation. Eva. Mm 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 mm. <laughs> Come on. Nope. Go there. Mm -mm. That's a wall. That is. <sighs> Why? Because my wall flies and my flyer also returns to my hand. I'm not too terrified of that side yet. But that one, that has trample, and I can't bounce away from trample. Target players. I haven't paid. I haven't paid one yet. Why'd you? Only, oh, oh, I see why. I mean, I could do it again if I really wanted to. Yeah. Hmm. Incremental value. There's thoughts going on. Yeah. 
I mean, because now we can talk. <laughs> oh, talk. Well, yeah, because oh, I don't have to pay for it. I don't even know why you targeted it in the first place. I don't know. I'm surprised. I'm still surprised you're not. Ooh, that's a good card. Uh, hitting your toothy to draw the cards. Because I, know you I can. have enough cards in hand that I need to worry about. Yeah. Like, but you're mono blue. But I've hit all my land drops. But you're. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, are we good? Like, I didn't I attack you in the first it? place. Why would I attack you when Buddy over there got me down to like 32 and I had to do all this to gain it back up? I mean, not like you weren't going to do it anyways. Uh, just hit other people. I, I would, but everyone else has efficient bloggers now. <laughs> I mean, I attack. can keep attacking you if that's what you would prefer. I mean, you could try. I, I probably Ooh. can. He just said your lifelink ain't enough. <laughs> I mean, not exactly Blue. what I'm saying. I debated making it a different color just to spite <laughs> myself. <laughs> You have enough blue sources, I'm sure you're fine. Mm. I'm not attacking. <laughs> I mean, I'll block. Will you, though? Yeah, probably not. I don't know how flanking and crab will work. Like, if you were to attack me, do I get a chance to respond? To the... Yeah, okay, it's a trigger. It goes on the stack. Yeah. Oh, that is... That's a good card. No, it's not. You should probably discard it. You should probably kill Hellkite before he can generate seven mana. I don't think he's generating seven mana in the first place. Nope. Uh, exile target now and permanent and opponent controls until it leaves the battlefield. Okay. Bye. So, mm. You gonna one mana counter? No. I'm playing Tribal Illusions. Boop. Yeah. Go ahead and make this arch enemy. Arch enemy? <laughs> <laughs> what you talking about, Willis? Oh, you know. I'm talking oh. about, like, I have no reason to target anybody else's stuff. Seth is attacking you. You've hit Danny and me. Why <laughs> should I do anything other than aid the fight? I was Switzerland. Mm. I was America until you bombed my Pearl Harbor. Mm. <laughs> Equilibrium. I haven't had anything to do. Equilibrium was Pearl Harbor. I like that. I mean, uh -oh. it was just as valuable. Uh, uh, hmm. Okay. It's instrumental to my strategy. Oh, okay. It was instrumental to the military. Like, okay. I'm not. I just wasn't sure, like, how that worked. In yeah, thinking is whenever know. you block too, right? Oh no, it's only blocks this creature. Oh, that's, mm -hmm. that's good. Yeah. I just, just it bounced me once and yeah. And now you want to be attacked for it. And Toothy's going to be hungry. Rawr. I mean, Seth's going to attack me too. Exactly. I thought Probably. you'd want friends. <laughs> Probably. Me and Danny, are, me and Danny can be friends. Wait, well, what? Him and what? Danny can be friends? Yeah, but you're going to yeah, be friends like Tomer. Friends like Tomer. <laughs> Don't worry. I I have ways I will go down in a blaze of glory. I'm you never have, worried. You got ways? Nobody walks into a game with tribal illusions and actually cares. <laughs> <laughs> I was just wanting to do something fun that I'm pretty sure no one in the right mind is going to do with Toothy. <laughs> Maybe inspire somebody else to bring illusion deck to their playgroup. You know, just fun stuff. I mean, oh, that's seven. That's good. Yeah, that's why we do it, right? Is it? No, oh, that's why I do it to bring the jank. That's a guard. It's a big old angel. Yeah, she is. Swan song. Doesn't hit creatures. I no. know. <laughs> and I would have totally used it on Banishing Light. <laughs> Fair. <laughs> Here. Go find your, your crap in life. Save targets. Always healed. Same the target. save targets thing. I like the save targets thing. That's a cool little thing that they've needed for a while. They had it for uh, storm spells. 
Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Well, it's, not, it's not branded. You can just then. hit same target, but it also doesn't say it. Yeah. Okay. It also Storm's a little bit different. Well. <laughs> or didn't. Hell yeah, I might use the ability. Where? Where now? Where is it? I. Guys, I clicked it, but it wouldn't go to my hand. <laughs> yeah. How great would it be if it put one into your deck? Like, that was the real mechanic? <laughs> no! From no. outside of the game, put a copy of it in your deck? Hey. Hey, buddy. <laughs> Come on, Seth. I thought we were friends. You hit me for five! I'm just trying to gain it back. Plus some. I can't control the fact that he's a 7-4. You can. I can't. All right, it's fine. Yeah, I'll let you have this one once again. How about this? You don't attack me next turn. I will stop attacking you. You did start it. I I started with everybody apparently. I know. I I first of all I second that statement. Hmm. I don't know if you can handle not attacking him anymore. Who me? Yeah. Why? Because he's got the gun to your head. I could just not attack him. Yeah, until you decide that you don't like what he's doing and punch him in the face for lethal. <laughs> I mean, Crab's not indestructible or have hexproof or anything like that, so I think it's fine. Well, I'm glad you think it's fine. Well, I'm saying, like, he, <laughs> he runs, thinks it's okay. he runs I mean, color or colors that can remove creatures. If you're easily. so worried about it, you could remove it. Oh, you... you're right, I could if I had an equilibrium. <laughs> I was gonna say, <laughs> if you're so worried about it, you could bounce this commander. I mean, if that's your only removal, then we gotta talk deck building. Alright, let's talk. Is that uh, your removal? Pretty much. You didn't want to do Pongify and stuff? Does Pongify say illusion? Does equilibrium say illusion? Do you think those are real creatures on that? I, I don't know what Mono Blue's doing, dude. Don't ask me questions you don't want to know the answer to. I don't know what's going on in this art. <laughs> that's, that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's like, Mono Blue's just doing a thing. Yeah, I have Pongify. No you could have uh, you could have swung Tootsie at me. I would have killed him for you. I don't want him dead yet. Because okay. I have too many cards in hand. That's fair. That is fair. Ooh. I've, I think I've seen this card before. I'm terrified of this card. It was just as impressive the last time. I was about to say. <laughs> I don't like this card. It's uh, it's it's a good card. So her toothy's been on the field one turn, and Two. Uh, Two no one. Two. Oh, one that's right, that's right. Yeah. Peer peers out. Yep. Yeah, I was about to say. And next turn, especially if she pays the simic, it'll be larger than mine that's been on the field since I could cast it. <laughs> then I'm talking sounds, about. That sounds like you problem. That was like Pierre's a really good card. Or combined toothy. with combined with Toothy, they're they're obviously the best. But oh. hmm. this works the way I want to do it. I don't know. Cast and we'll we'll tell you. What is it? God. The, first of all, this is not an illusion. Yeah, it's not an illusion. Got to right. your But uh, what color are all my illusions? Minus the lying one. <laughs> <laughs> minus the lying. <laughs> that traitor illusion over there. All right. I mean, you're saying your deck's not doing stuff, but it seems to be doing pretty good at stuff. You're reducing yeah, all your mana costs. Matter. I mean, maybe I can't really attack you effectively. So I have a six-six commander now. Holy crap! Oh, that's not right. A but what am I doing with it? <laughs> Eventually drawing cards, I would imagine. Yeah, I was going to say, again, like, you got a pretty effective feel that I can't really attack you. But what are the cards that I'm drawing? <laughs> More fleeting images? Maybe a Phantasmal Dragon, if I'm lucky? Let's talk deck building. <laughs> <laughs> now, it's, now it's like a please, please let's talk deck building. Toothy's just sitting here waiting for uh, Krob to get a little spicy. That's, that's all he's doing. Are you saying that Toothy's going to eat Krav? I think Toothy's going to bite Krav if he comes over to the wrong neighborhood. That's fair. 
Oh, oh, he left the man up this whole time. We thought he had a removal spell. It was just myriad landscape. Stifle. Ah, gotcha. Stifle. Oh, God. I quit. I quit. Mm. No. I oh, my God. <laughs> I was like, no, you don't. I'm going to start running it for just these situations. <laughs> just for the meme plays. Meme uh, and meme. They, they go together. I'll lose. I'll lose to stifle a land. Like, that'll be a victory for me. All right. What yeah, can believe I... it or not, there's not a lot of lords for illusions, so I had to cheat with blue creatures. Yeah. There's the blue, like, paragon, too, right? Yep, I have that one. That's what, That's an honorary illusion. <laughs> one, two, Ooh. three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ow. I could actually play both of my commanders. Please Should probably no. do it. <laughs> Please don't. I figure I'd be honest and, you know, polite about it. Um, I'm actually not going to, though. I'm actually going to Armageddon. <laughs> I'm not running that card. <laughs> uh, so far you've lied to us at least once. I said I'm not playing both my commanders. Yeah, that's that's why it's at least line. once. <laughs> I don't take back my statement at all. Point 0.5 lie confirmed. <laughs> Point 0.5. DM Cross will remember this. I will. <laughs> now when you play Corvath... At any point in the game. I remembered this. Search. Huh? You, you there you said... go. Shuffle your deck. You haven't gotten creatures except for this patrol. Go go fetch this thing. I feel like it's an insult to not search. Like yeah. <laughs> your your other commander is not worth my time. I mean well, unless I mean, like... like Go ahead. I was gonna say just unless like you put something on top. Yeah, like I have one black up, so if I were to Vampire Tutor and he has this. Well, I'm saying the two times you have targeted me, I have searched and failed to find. Yeah. Just because I was like, why not? It's a random card either way. Um, do that. Do that. Do that. Well, again, not if you like Vampire Tutor to put it on mm -hmm. top. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'll keep doing it, don't you? Don't you tempt me to be stupid. I mean, do I even need to tempt you to do that? No, not typically. Well, I will not attack you, DM. Yay! 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 I don't think I have to be too worried this turn. Yeah, okay. Nope. That's not indestructible. No. Nope. No. With your six six dragon, the uh, Eastern yeah. dragon. Suck it. I mm. forgot that your dragon got. Um... Are you still in attacks, or can you take it back? I hope uh, I can take it back. <laughs> take it back now, y'all. <laughs> take it back. Pull it back. One, One hop this time. time. <laughs> uh, I mean, told you, so... if you get bit, you come over here. I didn't since say. Since I didn't hit you, since I didn't hit you, DM, we're we're cool, right? I said, if you didn't hit me, I would not hit you. Yes. Boop. And then. I like the wording that you just used. Boop. I bet you didn't like that. Four, four, first strike indestructible. Now you can draw cards with Toothy if you want. Okay. Oh. Fun fact: He does not get the trigger from Path to Exile. Yeah, we know. We, we know. We know you're a terrible person. Fun fact, you just wasted a path to exile. Yeah. No, I didn't. I'm dealing you 10 damage. No, you aren't. I have two other Stuff, flyers. Yeah. Oh, okay. that's fair. <laughs> this was not the most profitable use. Oh, no, it's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. All right? Like, okay. Sir, I play this game to have fun, not to be good. Uh, <gasps> mm. I Too mean, easy. I'm not... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I know you have other flyers, but at least you can't kill it. That that was what really got me concerned, was I forgot you could trade with it. I'm just glad that you decided to tap your only flyer. No, that was fine. <laughs> uh -huh. You act like it's me that it's going to fly in there, and not the Simic player. That's yeah. fine. What's that commanders? Hey, when I 
when I first started this deck, I kind of knew from the get go I was going to make everybody angry because this deck it, it's red white. It swings. That's all it does. Yeah, nothing it's special. Real hard. So I'm going to upset everybody by swinging and doing what my deck does. Normally you do that in turn. Actually, I have to do this. I was about, yeah. I feel yeah, like I was the, say, uh, don't don't waste your fleet. The fleeter seems now. like it's a better card. No, no, the seven toughness might actually be a problem later. That's fair. I do have a trample commander right now. Mm -hmm. And he's running green. Red has ways to make trample, I'm sure. Oh yeah, duh. A red art type. And he just took it. Did you gain life this? Oh yeah, you did. Yep. I sacked my two soldiers that I got from Elspeth because I traded them in for warriors. Yep, yep. I got gotcha. you. Warriors, cards, life, one one counters. Shh. Everything's fine. I'm sure it is for you. You can still get past the indestructible field. Hmm. I don't know. I have a feeling that I'm going to get definitely slaughtered here pretty quickly. Did I not pay white? Didn't I make white off? Oh, never mind. I'm... Oh, it's fine. fine. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You. Oh, yeah. I don't know. If I survive till my next turn, I think I'm going to pull back a little bit. Stop angering everybody. Seems like something you can do. Maybe. We'll see. One, two, four, five, six. I have six mana. Oh, okay. So I can do what I want. What you combo really out? want? No, I can't combo out. It's not. It's only three. Everybody, so it's not even all that great. I get to draw the card off Mentor of the Meek. Until you can recur it. I mean, you're, times in one game. You're right. I. This is not as actually that much of a recursion deck, more of a token deck. I was I, I, referencing the stream. Wait, yeah. Did you just play Cabal Coffers this turn? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, okay. I. Okay. I see. I mean, you have looks, a strip mine, so. Looks like I'm pissing DM off now. That's what we're gonna do. We're gonna fight today. Okay. You can kill you next turn. Yeah. Guys, help me. <laughs> you were kind of the problem a second ago. I am. I am not going to attack because I'm like Boros. I don't feel the need to uh, be violent. Wait. <laughs> oh, never mind. I can't attack uh, Valdor because I said I wouldn't. I had a flying commander, and I was like, oh, I, I did. I was, I was 100% saving that for actually Krav, but again, I forgot about the, uh, I forgot about the fact that the dragon could kill me. 15. Don't 19, have any mana. 22? Are, are you counting up damage? Yeah, damage that you can deal if you play your commander. Yeah, because of flying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's not all getting through. Uh, the only uh, yeah. imagine you're not attacking me. I mean, <laughs> I can't really attack Seth either. Danny's done nothing to incur any pain. Yeah, but you're Boros. So you gotta end the game as soon as you can. That's fair. Uh, yeah, honestly, I was seeing how much you could do if you played your commander to see if you had a shot at stopping him. That oh no! Really... no. Ooh. Oh. oh, that's a good card. Danny, we, we have to talk here. She doesn't have to talk to anybody. <laughs> She's about to have a flying 7-7 seven, seven commander that's going to untap. Yeah. Somebody going to get hurt somebody. real yeah. bad. Um, always yield. Yeah, someone's most likely me. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't know. I hope it's not me, because I could have swung at Danny last turn and did not. Uh, at one point, that that logic has to go out the door. 
I'm not in a position to win the game, so if you're trying to say that I am, I'm not. No, I'm saying, yeah, I'm not either. What I'm saying, though, is the I could have swung at you and didn't visit thing. <laughs> like, at one point, somebody is going to... Oh, yeah, yeah, that. yeah. I'm yeah. just saying this turn. I'm not saying, like, she should never do anything to me as long as I never touch her until <laughs> I can win. That would obviously be crazy. I just thought yeah. you were, like, trying to say she sh like it, it, the right thing to do is definitely attack me this turn. I mean... Right thing to do is to probably get rid of Luxon on hand. Oh yeah, it probably would be a good thing to do. Yeah, uh, there's not really any good artifacts on enchantments otherwise. Time to pull up the deck list. See what I got. Hmm. Like yeah, a lot of blue wife. mana. Draw a card. Oh, you dropped the land, didn't you? Mm hmm. Um. I I will not kill your two three for you. I know you won't. That's why I'm not attacking. If if I wouldn't lose crab in the exchange, I would. But I would lose crab in the exchange, so I'm not gonna do that. Hmm. Ooh, crab's even bigger now. Oh yeah. Mind stone. Didn't even think about it. It works out. God, I need some card draw so bad. Apparently you need a toothy. I apparently I do. Instead of being Boros and having no card draw. So I don't know how much it is, but I could imagine if you were to do like a mono blue toothy deck, whether it's illusions or anything else, like utility lands that sacrifice would be really good, like high market. Mm hmm I just I'm trying to think of If you want to focus on Toothy's ability, yeah. Because blue does have a lot of draw power stuff, typically anyway, so... Mm -hmm. So Toothy in this deck is literally... It's kind of an engine. It sits and waits for a board wipe, because those are normally going to happen. Mm -hmm. And board wipes are a tribal deck's worst you know, thing, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So if I can just sit here with a Toothy, and it'll eventually die, and I draw a new hand, then... Oh well. That's, it's the big deterrent to, oh, I'm on board wipe. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then again, I'm drawing illusions. They don't have vigilance, <laughs> right? What? They don't have vigilance? No. Hmm. Just indestructible. Yeah. Um. And haste? I'm gonna. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I don't know why I'm apologizing, but you definitely think I need to get rid of this while coffers. Or it goes crazy, but. Fair. Unwelcomed, but fair. Yeah. Not really too badly wanting to aggravate people, but you know. It's a cabal coffers. I do have a bunch of swamps. Mm hmm. Full transparency. I have an expedition map on my hand. <laughs> I, mean, was, I mean, it would have gotten me one, two, three more mana, but. That's three more mana you don't need. Yeah. I'm already doing pretty well, I think. Mm hmm. Uh. Yeah. <laughs> Being a Boros deck, I just I don't have much going on. I think the problem with Boros is you have to make one person very upset. Yeah, it's hard to get a good enough spread. Yeah, to be you like... gotta play like in fact. You yeah. gotta, you're dying, <laughs> buddy. Sorry, it sucks. Ooh. They already have, have double the, strike. Not the knights. Yeah. Oh the yeah, yeah, no, you're yeah. Right. yeah. <laughs> Um, it's really cool to see them side by side on the battlefield. By the way, the two commanders. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, I, I get a point for this, don't I? No, there are no points. No. Welcome to Prayer Magic, where the rules are made up and the points don't matter. Oh, speaking Silver of Blade, you made him switch places. He moved oh, Hellkite sorry. back on my screen. So I, yeah, they're next to uh, each other to me. Okay. Uh, Paladin's next to Sylvia, which is mm -hmm. next to Korvath to me. Oh, not on my screen. So yeah, I was saying in, before uh, their art, Sylvia is obviously on Korvath, and here you can see Sylvia on Korvath in Korvath's art, so it's kind of funny. They're mm -hmm. not in the same... So I think the only two commanders that did this really well were... Um, we're not playing them, but... 
Virtus and Gorm, where like their art is basically the same exact thing, like the same poses, but from different perspectives, depending on who you're focusing on. They're back to back. Yeah. yeah. I was going to play them, but then it's just they make the mono black one unblockable. And I've played make my deck unblockable. So I was like, that just kind of feels like I'm playing two weeks ago. Really? I'm sure he's doing more I'm than that. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm spreading a little bit around. Spreading it to the same person so far. <laughs> I would love to attack Seth right now, but there's no problem. I don't see why he doesn't just attack you anyway. I mean, because I'm not going to go all out and I'm going to leave enough back so I could block. Oh, okay. If you were attacking all out, I'd be like, I don't know why you're not attacking me all out. But oh, yeah, I guess if, if you're, if if you're leaving back have, blockers, I guess. Yeah, if I could have attacked. Uh, and then that way, if he does come at me, I have enough back I could double block and hopefully live. Uh, not by my math. Not by your math? He could throw nope. enough. He could throw enough in front of crowd. I'd yeah. have to sack my whole board if that's what you think I'm going to do. Yeah, I have... Yeah, I have... Uh, no. Yeah, I have three blockers, all with double strike or first strike. You can still go up ten. Double strike can... doesn't matter if you're dead after the first one. Yeah. Well, so he can soak up ten damage. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, one... No, no, two, but what I mean, though, is I can block Krav, and the first strike will kill him before yeah. he has a chance to go through. No, him. no one... If I no if I sack way. my whole field, no one. Oh yeah. But no. again, I don't. I don't think I would sack my whole field just to kill him and then be left with nothing. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I I guess I'd have a bunch of life, but I like all my creatures would be dead. It's a conundrum. No, no, so. nobody's nobody's playing that Sphinx. Aha. Uh -huh. I don't know. Boop! All the damages. Mm-hmm. It's just a love tap. No, no, it was not. No, no it was not. You... What is it? A shyster? I think is the word I'm looking for. Shyst? Oh, that was first strike damage. Okay, we gotta go through this yeah. all over again. Mm -hmm. There's a little bit more damage. Danny. For Danny, there is. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Only the dragons had double strike. Mm-hmm. See, but now you're you're basically starting to make it so where he doesn't have to worry about anybody else. So wiping his field to take you out of the game is incredibly reasonable. Like it's what I'm curious about. That's fair. I mean, I if I had more card draw, I wouldn't be too upset to try to fix some issues, but I do not. Six, seven? Yar. Yar. Hmm. It's not a pirate, so I don't know why I yarded that. I don't know. It could be a pirate. It didn't be a boat. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, to this. I'll say this, if someone else could help me out, I'll gladly go to Seth. I mean, it's, you've kind of yeah. non-stop killed a creature a turn for me. I have no reason to help you. Do I just kill Elder now? Hey, go for it. I think you do. I you kill Valdor now, take a huge hit from Danny that doesn't matter because she'll be dead the next turn, and then, I guess, deal with me. <laughs> or you just draw one card. Your <laughs> options. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if it was me, I'd be drawing the card. All right. I mean, Pharaoh was not expecting the Overlord to come down and get him so many extra guys. 
No, yeah. I knew he had to have something. He's been drawing like seven cards total off of your commander, not every turn. I don't want to misrepresent that. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Well, that goes me. Do I get my equilibrium back? Yeah. Oh, cool. Mm-hmm. Oh. You just didn't force me to do anything. Yeah, I was dead no matter what I did, so... Like, I had no way of killing your guy, and... Okay. And plus, I accidentally f would Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, you should probably have no, still made me I want to... to I, I f would on accident. Okay. Fair enough. So... I still can't pay for this. Oh, well. I mean, you can. Nope. <laughs> can't pay for it. Can't or won't? What was the second one? That The second one was won't. It's I... like can't, just worse. See, if she gives this... Oh, she'd have to give it trample and double strike, I guess. Yeah. Draw that card. That's right. It's one of the only times you'll see a stop in the draw. Yeah. Sheesh. <laughs> so good. Ah, that's funny. Oh. Oh. That's oh. Way to get double strike. Wow. Does that put double double counters because of pure? Yeah. Oh my. Right. Toothy's just. Oh no, it's no, one no, more, it's one it more. It should automatically add plus one. Yeah. Uh, so Pierre's not gets... double, Pierre's hardened scales, not uh, doubling scales. Gotcha. Because if I say, if Pierre, uh, if Pierre was double, then you shouldn't have played Chasm Skulker and just killed somebody. <laughs> I mean, I have a flying blocker. Oh, you do, that's right. Yeah. You have many of them, my apologies. No, he does. God. It won't. I mean, it'll be helpful, but... Ooh, I don't really see how big I could make it. That's Fair what. Enough. That's what she said. She did say it. That's <laughs> she did it factually. Yeah. yeah, actually, factually, that is what she said. Nineteen twenty. You might as well yeah. hit me for ten. Oh, or hit me two ten. If she could have flashed that in, I think that would have killed you. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't hit you till 10 unless I hit you with my flyer. Well, if you would have given Toothy plus 2, plus 2 and flying. Yeah. No, you would have hit me to 10, which would have been a good thing to do. Mm -hmm. Because I have equilibrium back. Yep. Well, yeah, I mean, you now you could, you know, bounce her mm -hmm. Toothy and see if uh, I'm she'll draw into every something. creature on the field, unless oh. she has a counter spell. Well, in that case, because, I guess uh, I'll draw a bunch of cards. Guess what's an illusion? Oh. Uh, huh. It is an illusion. And it right? costs two less? No, it costs one less. Yes. Okay. So I am making even with bouncing it. At least if I did my math right. I may have done my math wrong, though. Mm -hmm. So you bounce. What's your first target? I can't see. What is that? I'm Two giving three. her her 18 cards okay. for, uh, incorrectly. That should be my last target. But yeah, yeah. I mean, for her hand size, it just go. <laughs> <laughs> that that's a thing. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I yeah. really wish I had a way to kill her chasm skulker at instant speed. Just to give her, that I'd be fine with it. This just to give her a million one ones. This is one of those cute things that you can do with illusions. That's pretty much it. <laughs> oh, she has all her mana up. Can she kill her Chasm Skulker? That'd be funny. Why would I kill it? So you, you would get thirty five one ones <laughs> with uh, Island Walk. That'd be so funny. Hold on. Hold <laughs> on, let me see what I can do. Pongify. Boop! That'd be funny. 
no, 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 no. She's got to go through 21 cards. She's hitting the little scroll button that's over here. Is that a card? Is that a card? Is that a card? Oh, I don't think I can do this again. I need more than that. I miscounted. Whatever. Uh -oh. That was that was my cute thing to show for the game. <gasps> Is she going to do it? No, that's that's exile, though. What does it matter? Because this isn't die. like Toothy. It has to die. Oh. Oh, oh no. no. It has to die to me. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, well. Do you have a Pongify? Or a. Uh, I do. Is it in your hand? Search for it really quick. Because I can counter, uh, put counter something your else. own reality shift. <laughs> <laughs> With Arcane Denial, draws a card. It's fine. It's whatever. I'm You don't up. have anything? Nope. I'm just going to. That's all I had. I'm That's gonna... fine. Are you sacrificing your, your field? Not the whole thing. I keep, I can keep up the flyers. Just the ground one ones, the ground tokens. Ooh. Nice. Very nice. Easy come, easy go. <laughs> mm -hmm. Like I said, I didn't realize it mattered, so. And yeah, it's because Toothy's weirded funny, so you were probably thinking it was like that. Hmm. So are, you're hoping to bounce all no, of your... No, I'm not going to. I don't have... Because yeah. even if, if I pay the four... Yeah, um, it takes six, right? Mm-hmm. I mean, did I navigate an illusion? That, no, it's not. Okay. <laughs> it's dead I know, Dater and Illusion. Stop it. Hey, it's a possible thing. Mm -hmm. I mean, that'd be kind of crappy because it'd mean he wins again. I mean, we're not keeping score anyway, it's fine. Says you. Your yeah. own personal vendettas are your problem. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't have any vendettas. Yeah. Nope, still can't pay for them. <laughs> Mentor of the Meek, well, you've drawn me one card. Now you can't pay for them. Still can pay more before. Uh, yep. I will yield to that. Sacrifice Ragna. Okay. I feel I was lied to. I was not. I said Ragna. okay, then I said no. So. Oh, I didn't hear the no. I was like, oh. oh. <laughs> well, I, didn't right, I didn't hear that either. Oh, man. Yar. Yar. Yep. Can I do it? Aetherized. She might. I mean, she has like 30 cards in hand. I mean, 20. There it's was close. A before it. It's called Like. That was before it. <laughs> <laughs> Anything? Oh. Fog would be fun too. Don't just to we... randomly fog you. God, I'd be so mad. If there was anyone to run it, it'd be her <gasps> too. She's got something. Evacuation. That draws you a bunch of cards too. Yeah, I'm like, I'm, I think I'm okay with that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I drew cards for her. She drew cards for me. We good. We good. Actually, me bouncing Toothy probably kept her in the game by accident. Yep. Yeah, because I drew that because of Toothy. Okay. 
You get nothing. Good day, sir. Two, three, four. And has? Did you know there was an illusion counter? <laughs> I figured somebody was going to have something. That's a legit creature. Whew. I was really well, hoping you don't have to. I only had counter target uh, creature. I was not prepared for this level of uh, deck. <laughs> Danny's got a lot of cards. Oh, she's got the counter. Nice. I figured. I figured. Now comes the real scary part. I meant for you to pass your turn at the real scary part, not play an expedition map. <laughs> it's not the real scary part. I'll be spitting my hand back out. Yep. Uh, that's a bad one. Is it bad or is it just misunderstood? Both. How many more do I have? Four? Um... Did you notice how one person I uh, did not get the memo for bring card draw decks. What? Oh, uh, he had Mask of Memory. Yeah. He's drawn almost, well, uh, until this last turn, he had drawn more cards than I had. Yeah, he did all right. Oh, boo. I, don't even I mean, <laughs> were you really surprised she drew no. 20 cards and then didn't get a Reliquary Tower? I, that's what I would have been surprised about. I don't draw a Reliquary Tower. Well, maybe you should. I'd have to put it in my deck first. Well, maybe you should. Oh, that's a definite. Where did it go? Where did it go? Right there. I, gave I want up. to cast something. I know exactly what I'm looking to cast, too. <laughs> I've got all these cards in my hand. What do I do? Ugh. There we go. I drew a proper island to replace that. <laughs> but was it a reliquary tower? Nah. I just like I'm to draw surprised. attention that uh, today it looks like everybody's basics match, except I think mine. I tend to usually have my basics match. I just typically fill. I don't really care. I'm never on theme, though. So... I used to no. I oh. used to play only the uh, Almanket lands, and mm -hmm, then mm -hmm. because Magic uh, Moto randomly gives you cards and stuff that you don't want, mm -hmm. I've inherited lands, and I'm like, so now when I fill, I'll have like one off island. So do you I'm go like, through why? all of them and like check? No, I used oh. to. For decks that I care about, I do, but okay. I just that's dedication. I wasn't making fun of you. I was just saying that's that's some no, dedication right there. I probably should. So I'm trying to figure out how to play. I have a lot of cards in hand. <laughs> First world problems. Right? Wish I had too many cards in hand. Do they? They weren't uh, next to each other in your hands. Seems like a party foul. They aren't next to each other on my hand. Mm -mm. I have the one I might go so infinite you. next turn. Really? Because she bounced uh phantasmal image. Oh. Hmm. All it does is bounce creatures, all right? It bounces itself. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I'm not doing a oh, mana gorger. Oh well, it yep. bounces one mana gorger. <laughs> just tap them all to make sure this happens correctly. Yeah. All right. Let's let's start by getting that out of here. <laughs>
Hmm. I can choose your guys' lands. Do it, you won't. You're right. <laughs> right after you sa have sacrificed Ragna, like you said. I said no right after. <laughs> I'm just giving you garbage for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You go infinite. But I what think do I you... generate one mana a turn. Okay. Um, or cycle. And I don't know if I'm like have a way to benefit from that. Well, as you've noticed, there's been like a little screen change and some things look different. And that's because uh we kind of figured out that John's won, and we just wanted to make sure that everybody understands how. So long story short. Uh, John's going to go over the steps really quick, but infinite mana, mind sinker. That's the basis of it. But if you want to explain exactly how you're doing it, you go right ahead, John. All right. Um, so this is a combination I didn't know I had. I am bouncing my um, phantasmal image uh, because Danny bounced it back. I, it went back to being a phantasmal image. And now because of the cost reduction, I can just keep generating mana with it to create Palacron mm -hmm. and then untap five, uh, the seven land needed. Yeah. And uh, then using uh, Equilibrium, I get to pick up Jace's Mind Seeker. I have infinite mana, so I just keep recasting it until I fully exile everybody's nonsense. Yeah, so and it's basically an infinite mill because of the infinite mana. Mm-hmm. So uh, as you can see from John's timer, he's down to almost 30 minutes, and he was at like 45 right before the white. So it's uh, it's intensive because of the amount of times and things he has to click and do to cycle through. So we wanted to save you guys from all that. Uh, we have agreed that because Danny and I are both tapped out and we don't have a way to respond to him milling us out, that he is going to win, but we wanted you guys to kind of see it in action, which is why he's still doing it in the background. So we're going to skip over to the outro, though. And uh, John, you're going to go last because you're still playing the game, so you actually don't get an outro. So... <laughs> Understood. <laughs> he can't do the outro until he's done playing. We we should do it in order of uh, how people die. So Valder, go ahead. Hi. <laughs> so would you would you like about your deck minus hitting people in the face really fast? I oh. mean, I liked that you could play two tribes at once. That was amazing. But you know what? I'm going to be honest. Boros deck was doing what Boros deck does best, which is try to hit people in the face as much as possible and then die because everybody else does better things. Yeah. A um, couple of things that you weren't able to see. Um, you know, I have a few non dragons and non knights in here. So I have a uh, Gisela, the blade of gold knight, just to hopefully add a little more punch to my you know, attacks. Yep. You know, I wasn't able to get out some of my card advantage, which is where, you know, Red White always suffers from. So Outpost Siege, Mind's Eye, never came across. And No, Windbirds? Huh? Windbirds Invocation? Or, I'm sorry, Funbirds Windvocation? Oh, I had that in the deck, but I had decided not to because majority of my cards lower CMC to try to hopefully get to the ground fast and furious. Okay. But the one card I really wanted to see that I never got to see, but was pretty upsetting, actually was, uh, there it is, uh, Turian Mauler. It, mm. Probably one of the best Dragon Slash Knights ever. That's true. Oh, that would actually, is Mirror Entity in your deck? It, Mirror Entity is in the deck also. Oh, everybody has flying double strike haste. Mm-hmm. And becomes as big as you can pay for it, I guess. Yeah, that would be one hell of a closer, too. It would. That was my hope right there. Mm. But, and in, the last card that I really wanted to see, but I never did, uh, Always Watching, which is the white-white colorless enchantment. Non-token creatures get plus one, plus one on Vigilance. Mm. I just feel Vigilance is really, really needed when you're a deck that wants to... Yeah tap out or to swing with everybody every turn. Yeah, because that was kind of what you were talking about right at the end. You were worried that if you swung out, you wouldn't be able to block me. Yeah. So you did need, you needed something to try to keep blockers up, and that would have probably changed the math a lot. You would have I, not felt as bad about attacking me, or like and before, as before it goes into the comments, yes, I know I punched it. I should have 100%. 
at least tried to block Krav, but I I F two'd. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Yay for uh, technological uh, defaults. So yeah. But overall, I liked your deck. I like I liked how your deck curved out really well. By th- turn three, you had three creatures on the field, and you were swinging a lot of damage. Uh, yeah. For that early turn, which is what Boros needs to do. Um, it does, and I, I mentioned it before. Um, unfortunately, about Boros though, is I either swing all out at one person, which takes them out of the game and just kind of makes it not fun for them, or I try to divide my attacks, and then it becomes I anger everybody, and I have no allies or. Friends. Yeah. So take what I could get. Yeah, that's fair. Um. I think overall for my deck, I just needed to stabilize a little bit more. Um, I think the turn after this was going to be pretty good because I had Return Dust and Austere Command in the deck, and that could have potentially gotten me, um, like, could have dealt with what John was doing. I will say that I have exactly four demons in the deck, and I do have Liliana's contract. <laughs> Still wanted it to happen. So who knows? Maybe in the next few uh, decks that have black in them, you'll just see Liliana's contract randomly pass by, and you'll be like, "Why is he still trying?" I'll be that'll be my my moon folk with uh, Liliana's your contract. Cauldra. Yep, gotta get it, man. I gotta get it. Uh, I what I really need to do is go all out and do a uh, Vidalcan Orrery so that I can flash it in at the end of somebody else's turn when I already have the demons out. That's what it's gonna need to be. And actually, with white, it wouldn't even be too bad because I could do Grand uh, Abolisher so that it would be harder for people to... Oh, no, because I would have to flash it at their turn. I don't know. I'll, I'll find something, I'm sure, to try. <laughs> but, yeah. I didn't get it this week. And it was kind of a funny infinite combo because John's still going. Oop, that's my background. I got the chance to cast your Damnation. Oh, uh, you didn't want to damn Damnation? I, I think you'd get mad at me for basically casting... Armageddon damnation. <laughs> but all right, Danny, what John's still going, so uh he's still last. Uh what about your deck? Was you you had uh you were still scary. I think who knows, maybe you should have killed John with your big old uh whatchamacallit guy. Yeah. Probably. I get enough creatures out, so I'm a little disappointed in that. I have like four different hydras in my deck. Ooh. You only saw the one. You have the Hydra Colonian Hydra, I think, where it doubles the one yep. counters. Ooh. Yeah, when I drew all those cards, I got my Crater Hoof Behemoth in here. <gasps> the I ultimate green closer. My... Mm-hmm. Um, Luxidin Can, the Lux Cannon. Sorry, not Luxidin, Lux Cannon. Ooh. That, that would have been funny. So, Danny, I have to ask Did you ever consider Triumph of the Horde? What does that do? Uh, everything gets plus one, plus one, trample, and infect? I think I have it. Yes! Yeah. Finally! Finally! I convinced her to play a little bit of infect. To be fair, like, come on, she had an 18, 18 commander. You just can't make it a 19, 19 trample infect. Why wouldn't you kill somebody? Why wouldn't you kill somebody? But, yep. I think your deck was cool. I think it was very synergistic. I think, um... Not having the creatures early is kind of what hurt you, but mm-hmm. you never know. Could have played out. Uh, Could have played out very differently. So, all right, John, we're back to you. We're seeing your forty-one warrior tokens. Your yeah, nine manias. Uh, this was never the intention, and this is obviously why this was never the intention. <laughs> so I was uh, really hoping to have Bantu's monument, and I was just drained you out by now. So tell us about it. Oh, so how how many monuments do you have? I have all, all of them except the green one and the red one. Oh, okay. Would I like to cast Wrath of God? No, I'm good. <laughs> no, 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 no. Do it. Do it. You won't. You're, you're right. Yeah. Factual statement. <laughs> the outro turns into the rest of the game. It's like, nope, we're going with it. Yeah. <laughs> if you can't pilot the deck right, you don't deserve to win. Well, then... If the timer is an indicator, I don't deserve to win. I mean, if if we had uh, focus more once we realized the combo, I think it would have been. What am I at? Twenty nine cards. Danny's still at sixty. Oh yeah, you would have a while. Um, I, that's one of the the 
hard parts about playing online as opposed to playing at the table. Because if this was playing at the table, we would have just said, yep, John won. He yep. infinite out. Here's Sh- your loop. Shuffle up. Go to next game. Yep. But- I mean, even at this, like, I get down to, let's say I do this for another three minutes and, like, implicitly target just, or explicitly target just Danny to get her low in um, her deck two. Then even if you cast Austere Command, I sit here and just try and outweigh your guys' timers yeah. or draw steps. And that's that's the fun way to play Magic. Well, knowing, you know, Magic Online, you would do all this, wait till you had like five minutes left, and then somebody, if it was a random game, would Cyclonic Rift you. Yep. Because <laughs> that's the right card for this game. I don't know. I played, I played two mono blue decks and have not put it in either of them. <laughs> well, hopefully nobody's put it in their blue deck so far this season, if you know what I'm saying. Huh? Oh, I huh? do. I was just making a appeal that you don't need it. Yeah. Rivers Rebuke is Wizard's apology. So, um, any last words from you then, buddy? As you Please continue? make it so I don't have to keep clicking. <laughs> you can stop. <laughs> We've seen the combo yes. now. We're, we're watching the loop now, so you can stop if you'd like. Alright. Well, it was fun. I'm going to keep clicking while you guys finish up and finally free me from this pain and agony. All right, so uh, as John continues to torture himself, you can always follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, or Twitch. They are all whatever the site is, slash Pretty Magic. So YouTube.com, Twitter.com, Twitch.tv, Facebook.com, slash Pretty Magic. Uh, me personally, I am at DM underscore cross Danny. What are you? At Danny underscore cross 30 on Twitter. Val- Valdor. You could find me at uh, Valdor19 and tell me how horrible I played and what <laughs> I could have been better because I know there's something. No, no. Do that in the comments down below so that we have a running list. Uh, <laughs> John, <laughs> your your handles? I am at I don't support you on Twitter and I don't believe in any other social media. <laughs> so um, the streams on Twitch are Mondays, either Wednesdays or Thursdays and Fridays. Uh, we play 3DH and we also have our live podcast, which comes out on SoundCloud and Libsyn right now. And we're looking for some of the things as well as we do the video one that does come out on YouTube. So if you're following us here, you'll see it. Uh, just, you know, try to find those audio ones for on the way to work or whatever it is. Uh, we are in our second giveaway ever. If we hit 300, 400, and 500 subscribers at each milestone, we will find two names of people who are sharing our videos with the hashtag MOCL to send them a free Commander versus playmat. Uh, of course, thank you guys for getting us to the 150 that we were going with our last giveaway and getting us to the 200 for this first milestone. We have two people that we're going to be giving playmats out to very soon. Our next video is very exciting, at least for me. I'm going to reveal the theme because I'm excited about it. Uh, kills the Ravnica. Ah. By the oh, time this is... Fire mind. All right. You know what? Your your entire guild are traitors, by the way. So I don't want to hear. We only have a guild pack because of my guild. And now you're going to betray us the bolus. Way to go. And then it's up to my guild to save us all. So. Is it your guild also traitors? No. <laughs> When it comes to Ravnica, I'm a Demir mage. That's what I was, and Danny and John can both vouch for me. I was Demir. I tried to make it work so hard. It didn't, by the way. It didn't work. Mill is bad for standard. And uh, I'm glad we're not doing it this year, because we got so many cool cards. I was Azorius. Oh, God, uh, yes. We all remember. Pain, pain. This is where she got her love for Sphere of Safety with the Taint stuff. Anyway, guys... We're going to get out of here so John can stop clicking stuff. Follow us on all of our social media. Comment down below if you want to think about uh, what decks we could play, what commanders we could play, future themes. Follow, like the video if you liked it. Share it with the hashtag MOCL to enter the giveaway. And we'll see you guys next time. Peace.